Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Jams. This is episode 20 of my hand tied jig series, and today I'm going to be showing you how to tie a blue and white crappie jig. So let's go ahead and get started. The jig I'm using today is a 1 8 ounce new age minnow head. I painted it with some disco silver and candy blue on top and then some white on the bottom and put a 5mm blue eye on it. First I'm just going to lay a little bit of super glue onto the hook. Then I'm going to take my thread and wrap a nice little layer of thread all the way down even with the point of the hook. The thread I'm using today is some Danville's 2 tin denier flat wax nylon in white. Next I'm going to dab up any excess glue with a small piece of paper towel and then I'm going to cut the thread. For the tail for this jig, I'm going to be using a white marabou feather. So for sizing, I want it to be about the length of the hook, and once I have it lined up, I'm going to begin wrapping it very tightly, even with the point of the hook, with my thread. Now I'm just going to take my thread and wrap it all the way up to the head of the jig, and then cut off the excess feather. Then I'm just going to take my thread and wrap over the feather just a little bit more to make sure it's tied in all the way, and there's a nice little layer of thread on the hook. For the flash for this jig, I'm going to be using some dark blue crystal flash. I'm going to take a full strand and cut it in half, and then cut that half strand in half again and double it. And I'm going to put it up at the head of the jig and begin wrapping some thread over it to kind of tie it in at the head like this. And then rotate it 90 degrees where it's parallel with the hook and tie it in with thread all the way down even with the point of the hook and then go back up to the head with the thread again so that the flash is tied in all the way. For sizing, I want it to be just past the end of the feathers, so I'm going to cut it right there. And that looks pretty good, two pieces of flesh on both sides. For the body, I'm going to be using some of this dark blue crystal chenille. So I'm just going to take a strand of it and tie it in at the head and wrap thread all the way down even with the point of the hook and back up to the head again. And I'm just going to set my thread off to the side. Next, I'm going to use the rotary function on my vise to spin the chenille and create a body all the way up to the head. You want to make sure it stays uniform in the same depth all the way up the jig, just like this. And once I'm up there, I'm going to take my thread and begin wrapping under and over the chenille, even with the head, to tie it in to the jig. Just like this. A few wraps on both sides will work. And then I'm going to cut off the excess chenille and take my whip finishing tool and do a double whip finish right at the head to make sure that this jig is never going to fall apart and four or five more wraps and there we go now i'm just going to take my scissors and cut the thread and there you have it a killer blue and white crappie jig now all that's left to do is bag this jig up put a sticker on the bag and these things are ready to get out and catch some fish i hope you all enjoyed this video if you're new make sure to subscribe and i'll see you all in the next episode of hand tied jigs